I had a dream. I had a dream. It wasn't as great as you're making it sound. Yeah. Basically, I was dreaming that you and I were waiting to use the toilet. Right. And the toilet doors were see-through. Oh. And there were several people sat in the cubicles with a see-through no. door, sat on the cubicle no. with the trousers around their ankles because no. they were men. No! Yes. No. No, you know, that's a thing, though. Like, they, that means something. Any dream people out there, mm. what do we call these dream people? People who are into dreams. Right, yeah. Who know the meanings. Experts. There's something to do with a see-through toilet. Right. It's some sort of triggering thing in the brain. Is it? Yeah. I don't know if it's, like, lack of privacy. Maybe or... it's something about people seeing this shit that I <laughs> spew out. <laughs> This is an intro to our London vlog. The vlogs are sometimes a bit all over the place, so we like to give you a bit of context. Actually, this one wasn't too bad. I and I'm going to say... What? The reason they're all over the place is because we're having such a bloody brilliant time. Yeah. We forget that's what we're there for. Yes. And there's a lot to think about. Yes. You, yeah, you get, like, music in the background. You get this happening, that happening. We're trying our best to flip in film these things that happen to us. Yes. But the funny things usually happen when we're not recording. We actually need a camera person to follow us around. Yes. Imagine that, and then we could just watch the day back, oh, pick the good bits. That would be hilarious. Anybody up for that job? Please. That would be amazing. That would be hilarious, because then it would all be on instead of us telling you yeah. about it afterwards. Yeah, because, like, been there, done that. When it's happened, yeah. it's like... Yeah. Let's do a positive card, because that's something else we missed out on the video. And yeah. then we'll let you see us okay. wandering around London. Yeah. Causing havoc. Yeah, well, no, I wasn't. <laughs> you were. What did I do? Dropping me right in the shiz. That's what you were doing. What did I do? Well, they'll find out. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> 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 right, pick Makes a card. Make me like a right plonker, Bobs, <laughs> won't you? I'm sure you do it just to piss me off. Right. <laughs> oh, yes. What? I am good enough. Oh, that's lovely. I am good enough. Good being the italic word, which means we have to stress that. Yeah, okay. good. I am good enough. enough. Yes, you are. I am good enough. Good enough? Good enough. You know, when you say it like that, yeah. it doesn't sound like the word that I was thinking that it was saying. Why? You know, when sometimes you make too much of a oh, word and yeah. then the word changes in your head yeah. and you're thinking, that doesn't Wait, sound Wait, is right. that even the word anymore? Yeah. Yeah, totally get that. I think that with people's names. Like, yes. Why are certain words a name? It's just a sound. Yes. Like, why isn't table someone's name? Yes. Tell me that. I don't know. Will you call your children t table? I mean, I could if I wanted to. We well, could. I have the power to name a human. Yes. That's weird in itself. You named me. I you know. You gave me this for the rest I of my know. life. I know. That is pressure. Right, anyway. Yeah. Let's roll the London vlog and we'll see you again at the end for a lovely shout out. Okay, How cool. Enjoy that? it. See ya. Bye. Today's like a school trip, isn't it, Bobs? Well, I feel like I've tagged on your school trip. Yeah, so what we've done she is... She sold me a dream. <laughs> Come here. What we've done is, I'm bringing it to the last day of Freddie Mercury. Um, uh, what's it called? No idea. It's not a sale at Sotheby's, but it's... I think it is a sale at Sotheby's. It, right, he died before McKenna was born, so she knows very little. She knows the music, she knows very little about yeah. the man. I thought, a bit of education, right? A bit of a school trip, I'm gonna take her. We're going to go round Sotheby's and um, have a look at this amazing exhibition before it's all sold off. So, I mean, come here, Bobby, come oh. and stand here. Oh, come and stand here in front of all the river, Tom. <laughs> um, yeah, so we thought, so we thought that we'd, uh, we didn't, I thought that I'd bring her here. Oh, no. Oh, God. That's what happens when you go on holiday and you do that. <gasps> keep your chin down. Yeah, keep your chin up, Bobs. Oh, oh no, oh. down, down. <laughs> So, we've come to get in the queue. Anyway, the queue's not very long at the moment. The taxi driver said, I cannot believe how small this queue is. So that's great news. So we're going to just nip off, grab a coffee. You've missed and, all the flipping um, key points. Oh. She made us get a train at seven in the morning. So I got up at five, right? And then it turns out this place doesn't open till 11. It's now quarter past nine. So... Bobs, I'm not gonna lie. I think you're um, stressing about things you don't need to stress about. The fact is we're at the front of the queue. We've uh, spoke to a nice lady down there and she's saved a place for us while we nip off and get a coffee and I'm going to grab her one while we're there. So uh, we're just here to enjoy ourselves. It's going to be 28 degrees. We can't believe how lucky we are with I the mean, weather. I mean, we've not seen it yet. The fog has only just lifted. I watched the sunrise. <laughs> Jesus, 
Anyway, she's going to be flipping along in this later, aren't you, Bobby? Yeah. Okay, so we're, we're going off to walk down King's Road now. Have you ever seen anything more stunning in your life? Those heels are stressing me out. It looks like you're going to tip forward if you stand in there. Oh, wow. Look at that dress. Oh, wow. Whoops. Okay. It's me. Cartier, Bobby. <laughs> Cartier and Ralph Lauren. I mean, come on. I love a bit of Ralphie. Now Andrea said to me, yeah. obviously because she's got me out of bed so early, she's yeah. gonna treat me. Yeah. So what are you treating me to? <laughs> I don't I don't <laughs> believe I said that. <laughs> Bob's. That one's there. Got my name on it. I love the fact that I can make people happy in any form, even if it's just an hour of their life. If I can make them feel lucky or make them feel good or give a smile to a sour face, that to me is worthwhile. Gold. This is actually from a milkshake. Is it? Mm. Can you taste the chocolate? Oh my god. Oh. oh wow. What you gonna have? Oh. oh. Oh, look, I, oh. Okay, this is bad news. I'm not on sugar right now. And I can't make decisions, so. <laughs> it's when you can't be bothered to go into the changing rooms. That's all right, Andrea. Look at the state of us, we're melting. We're melting. melting. It's 28 degrees. What's happening? I thought I had a car, actually not. No, it's just shiny. Just shiny because of the heat. I don't know which hole to look at. Where am I looking? Which hole? Which dot? The dot, dot, dot. That one okay, really right, one. looking over there. Mm -hmm. Have lunch at Peggy Portion. The lighting there was absolutely terrible. It's so, a shame it's so pretty. Oh, there. so pretty. But it made us look like we we're aliens, didn't it? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Gave the lighting like a, a hue that I've not noticed yeah. on me before. And it was quite loud in there to be Yeah, it was loud. Loud music. Yeah, music. Um, anyway, that was absolutely stunning. We had a stunning lunch. And then, when did the funny thing happen? Before or after? Just before we went into, <laughs> into the exhibition. Right. She can tell you what happened before we went into the exhibition. It's one of those times where it's not funny when I retell it, but if you were there, it was hilarious, right? It's just my sense of humour. So um, Andrew wanted the toilet and we were so close to being let in and we were right at the front of the queue, so we had to be quick. So We, we had, had a full-on 20 minutes. Yeah, but it was like, it was touch and go it really, was. because the, to get to where the toilet was, was like the other side of the building, which was a long way away. So um, I'd just been, and I was trying to direct Andrew to where it was, and I knew it was like there were these steps up and there was this yeah. Sugarby sign. Yeah. So I was like, oh, that's it, like that. So I pointed in and she had to like get through the queue, get to this man on the door. I thought, oh, the man's changed, but I didn't think anything of it. No. And she went, <laughs> there was a sign that said exit only as well. I thought, I don't remember that before, but anyway. Um, can, can I come into the toilet? And he went, no, 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 no. And she went, <laughs> yeah, I'm going into the toilet. Because she thinks I've just been in. And I'm stood there thinking, I don't recognise, like, it doesn't look the same. <laughs> it going, gets worse. She's going, he's going, no, no, no. And he's like, kind of trying to get her out. And she's like, come on. 
think he's joking. He's not joking. Well, well, I think he's the a security words, guard. He's not joking. I think the words I used were, "Don't be daft." <laughs> don't, be, don't be silly. Don't be silly. Come on, don't be silly. <laughs> oh yes, please. Thank you. Yeah. Agua. So, um, so, so she's going like this to the security guard. <laughs> Don't you see that? Yeah, yeah. Thinking he's joking, but he's not joking. Oh, it wasn't oh joking. God, I was actually dying. He almost wanted to manhandle me out there. And <laughs> as I literally, thank you, darling, as I literally got like wee wee, like centimeters from needing to be released. Oh, and oh, it's the next one. The next entrance, it says entrance, it's got the same sort of be sign, different man on the door. Different door. man. Was that not a bit of a clue, Bob? Apparently not. We I then mean, spend the next 20 similar. minutes you pissing your pants laughing. <laughs> I thought he was messing about with me, I thought he was having a joke. Oh, only you. We get back, we walk around the rest of the building to get back, the line started to go in. Oh, yeah, we had to sprint. We had to sprint. Yeah up the line get in there it was all that kerfuffle with the wrong man <laughs> all that kerfuffle honestly only us oh dear so we found ourselves now in um sloan square don't judge i'm drink this from the bottle no the no rats wee on the bottles and who's is that hair on the bottom of it oh not mine oh see somebody's had it right around the head <laughs> <laughs> found myself in sloan oh, square it's pretty beautiful around here with some very stylish older people, right? Yeah. I've Show noticed that. Over there is the most classy Zara you will ever see. Show you. What? Oh, like this. Well, you know what? I could take them in. I'll take you in in a minute. It's air -conned. It's really nicely laid out. It's very zen, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Actually. You walk in and I don't feel like I'm frenzied to pick up everything that's on there. I feel like, take your time and look around. I mean, you still did pick up some stuff. Yeah, of course I did. It's Quite Zara. easily. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Let's go and have a look around Zara. I'll take you around there in a moment. Anything else to report? Right now, no. I'm just taking the day as it comes. Drinking from the bottle. <laughs> Zara? Yeah. This is such a posh Zara. Look! Oh wow, look where we are! See if you can guess. What? I'm not sure I can even, even describe what's going on here. Look at that. That's a cocktail glass with an olive in it that matches that handbag. What the actual. Oh God, and there's another one there, McKenna. I wish it was my birthday in October. Straight away. And have you seen these, look? Oh, oh these are beautiful. Watermelon. Oh god, it could all go so terribly wrong. How nice is that? <laughs> right, my lovers, we're back. <laughs> watermelon i'm feeling hydrated oh there's nothing better than a bit of watermelon on a oh, hot no. day it was the hottest day but it actually wasn't it wasn't the hottest it wasn't day. the time yes yes of that week of absolute beautiful weather yeah we had such a laugh i came back and i said to mckenna my heart is full <laughs> we laughed we had shiz going down we the ate usual. we drank not alcohol because i'm off sugar right now sorry what she is off sugar but she does dabble in the sugar i don't dabble well, i've got you, you oh did. that was weird i thought what? it was a spider on my foot it oh. was purely pins and needles i removed four spiders from my room last night one of them was a daddy long legs. Does that count? No, it's not a spider, Bobby. Okay. It's a daddy long Three legs. spiders from my room last night, all in the space of about 20 minutes, if that. Were they all living in the same position? Good sizes. No, sprinkled around. Under the bed, in the bathroom, outside the bathroom. 
Well, let me share this with you. What? Me and Carter sat in the kitchen the other day. Yeah. Uh, he drew attention to something in a very loud way. <laughs> I thought, what the f is that? Don't. It was a spy... Right, I am not exaggerating. I mean, it wasn't this bit, but it was like this, yeah. right? It was so big, it didn't even run. It sauntered into the middle of the room oh, and looked dear. like it was going to tap Buddy on the shoulder and say, excuse me, mate, can you move? It was that big. Oh, no. It was massive. We went and got the spider catcher. We've told you about spider catchers before. Best invention ever. Oh, yeah. That, you know, like those um, that you pick up a newspaper off the floor. What would we do without that? I have no idea. It's got like a, a trigger at the top. Yeah. And at the bottom, it's these very soft... Yeah. Uh, I have one. Do you want me to show you? Yeah. How is one. it? In here. If anybody's not got one and you need one, then get this. This is a lifesaver. I mean, Literally. I think you can get them from Amazon, maybe Argos. Show us how this it works. This is not an ad. <laughs> <laughs> what has that child turned into? <laughs> Andrea's a spider, right? Yeah. Oh, it's got my hair on it. <laughs> so I go like this. Right. Spider, come down here a bit. Right. So we need a full view of what's happening. Right. Here. So there's a trigger here yeah. that makes this go. Like yeah. That. So get the spider. Yeah. It gently yeah. grabs the spider. Yeah. Spider is now in bristles. Yes. I run like yes. a mad woman yes. to the furthest point of the country. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And release. Yeah. Close to the ground so you're not dropping it from a height. Yeah. Then spider is happy. Yeah. Human is happy. Bob's your uncle finish your arm. I mean, I'm horrible because I'd sooner batter it and be done with it. But everybody's told me I'm not allowed to do not it allowed. and it's bad karma, so I'm not doing it. Yes. But... I do need big brave pants on when this goes yeah. down because I am squealing like a piglet. The thing is, at the moment, it is spider season. It is Clearly, spider season. They're everywhere. Well, I don't know why. They just why don't they live this? outside? I'm, you tell me. I've got a shout out to give. Oh, brilliant. Um, new laundry pad to remind me that when we go out because I thought that would be good for there to get like a, um, you know, like the fairy that's unscented wash powder so that we can wash their blankets with unscented stuff so that doesn't aggravate their sensitive skin yes see what i mean i've got you um very non-bio or something like that i suppose to be doing a shout out sorry right? we've got dogs with allergies right now <laughs> see, apparently, apparently we thought we got fleas <laughs> oh don't this is a whole new story in itself are we boring you we kind of need to tell them don't we we do now it's not funny it's actually not funny. It's not funny at all. It's not funny. This happened while Andrew and Andrew were away. So me and Carter are holding down the fort, right? And it just so happens that when they're away enjoying themselves, we think the dogs have got fleas. This has never happened to us before. In all years we've had no. dogs, which is my whole entire life, yeah. we've never fleed a dog. We've never had to. No. It's never been a thing for us. Oh my God, this has opened a new can of worms, yes. hasn't it? Yeah. So the puppies came in and they were itching and it just felt like all of a sudden so i rang andrew i was like do you think the dogs have fleas because <laughs> they're itching and he uh, tj had a pimple on his tummy and she was like yeah they definitely got fleas bearing in mind this is 10 o'clock on a saturday night right all the shops are just shut we have no way of getting hold of any flea stuff we rang petrol stations we rang boots pharmacy like we were trying our yeah, best right yeah. so we thought right let's wash them if there's any fleas on there it might just like get them off um, so we washed them. Then the next day, we spent from morning till night washing everything in the house, cleaning the entire house top to bottom. Which, incidentally, was wonderful because Andrew and I are away, so we're thinking, oh, yeah. great, we come back to clean the house. house. Exactly. Ta da! Anyway, <laughs> um, then the next day, we went to Pets at Home, got them some flea stuff, fleed them. Fine, whatever. We fleed all four dogs, even though Bonnie and Buddy never itched. Then that was probably yeah, a clincher. Yeah, definitely. Anyway, we're just amateurs at this, clearly. So then um, they're all fleed, but then the babies start itching again and they're getting more red and we're like, what the hell? We fleed them. What more can you do, right? So we took them to the vets. It turns out BB and TJ have seasonal allergies, <laughs> right? So it's very common for dogs nowadays. They have more of like a rash thing now, don't they? It's yeah. not bad. She said it's totally like no, it's nearly controllable. Gone, yeah, but we thought they had fleas. So I think that was a scare to show us you do need to flee your dog. Yeah, especially when two puppies like to run about in bushes and trees and just be dirty. Yes, generally. Yeah, um, but they don't have fleas. Thank the Lord. 
they have seasonal allergies so we're just talking about what we can do to help with that some different wash powder maybe okay for sensitive skin okay got you i've also ordered them some probiotics for their food fabulous yeah so we're we're making moves to try and help yeah them. yeah these puppies are costing us a fortune <laughs> you'd never believe it <laughs> If they weren't so cute, I might be a tad upset about that, but they are cute. Life is good. Yes. <laughs> anyway, that's how we... Back to the shout-out. Back to the shout-out. What a nightmare. Um, no! What? You stop touching my foot. I didn't know I'd touch your, your foot. Your is to... You're just giving me a heart attack, I'm on woman. I'm high alert because these flipping spiders, that's what it is. Today's shout-out goes to Leah. Leah. Now, this is a special shout-out. Right. Leah's mum has got in contact with us. Leah from Ireland. Love Island. She's celebrating her 14th birthday this week. Yeah. And her mum, Michelle, and her love watching the videos together. Oh. So she wanted us to give her a shout out for her birthday. Oh, happy birthday. Happy birthday, Leah. Hope you're having a great birthday week, Leah. Do I need to sing? If you need to, yeah, go for it. Oh, I'm not sure I can, you know. Why? Somebody told me I couldn't sing the other day. Oh, yeah. <laughs> do I do it or not? Just because you can't sing doesn't mean you shouldn't. Oh. <laughs> I'm not sure that's even helpful. <laughs> you can sing. I love your singing. That's what I told this person. That they <laughs> went like, they literally put their head in their hands and shook their head like this. I'm singing. <laughs> I'm in the store and I'm singing. <laughs> I, I don't mind. So I said that I just sing because I'm happy oh. and it makes me feel good. Well, that is enough. So shall I sing a happy birthday then? Yes, go for it. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Leah. Oh, yeah. Happy birthday to you. Oh, there you go. That was lovely and... Thank you. Totally in tune and beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> I believe <laughs> you. Because I choose to. <laughs> when, when a thought becomes... Your reality... Oh, no, wait. Mm. When a thought becomes a belief, it's a reality when a reality... <laughs> There's a quote. I don't know what the quote is. Right. But if you believe something enough, it becomes your reality. You I'm a good it. singer? Yeah. Sod it. I am. <laughs> there you go. There you are. Mariah Carey, watch out. <laughs> I'm changing that to that. What? I'm changing the four rules to five. Okay, tell us then. First of all, like the video. Like the video. That's the blue thumb, right? Yeah. It turns blue when you click it. Yeah. Second of all, I'd really like you to subscribe because if you don't subscribe, you can't come in. It's like mm, it's like coming in after the sh store shut. Right, okay. Yeah? Kind of mm. not. <laughs> like we are open 24 hours. <laughs> ah, bugger. Well, it's mean, VIP pass. VIP pass. If you're a subscriber, you've got a VIP pass. Let's yeah. put it that way. Duh, duh. Share was with a friend because we want lots more people that are up for a laugh, yeah. right? That is the main point to this. Everybody's yeah. in a good mood and want to enjoy themselves. Uh -huh. Comment. It's getting harder to pin the fingers down. <laughs> and the fifth one, the new one, is check out the Instagram. Yes. Because I've learned this new thing that we can link up the Instagram with the YouTube. What do you mean? Well, once we, like today, for instance, just because you put up a YouTube um, video, I've put up my own Instagram. So, okay, this is called, um, Planning. what's the word? Cohesive. Hmm? Cohesive. 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 Cohesive social medias. Cohesion. Ooh! Ooh! That's what I've done. Yeah. Actually, I've timed it for 6.30. Right. So that then you get to look at it afterwards. Right. Oh, I love that. Well, Thank we always you. leave the Instagrams in the description. And yeah. the TikTok, if you fancy a little look. Yeah. Um, we're trying our best to be more on top of that, aren't we? Yes, we are. Yes, because it's a lot of fun, isn't it? It is a lot of fun. We enjoy it. But yes, we do. And one more thing. That's six things. No, not for them to do, for me to do. What? I've got to go get rid of this dry skin on my legs. Look. Oh, dear. It's all right going on holiday, but I'm starting to go like a scaly snake. Oh, dear. Once you've done those four mm. things... Pardon me. No, sorry, surely not. Again. Surely mm. not. Sorry, pardon. <laughs> Once you've done those four things, five things, six things, I've lost count, we'd be so incredibly grateful, and we'll see you next Monday at 5pm with a brand new video. Bye!